Hello, angels. Welcome back to Spiritual Lux Oracle. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and your subscribes. I truly do appreciate it. Personal readings are uploading right now. Personal readings are available. The link is down below. Before I even was ready, and like the video started on its own. Okay, so I feel like this love is happening unexpectedly. Like you you could have met you could have already met this person and it was unexpected. This is absolutely my reading. You could have already met this person and it was unexpected, or this is about to happen for you. I'm hearing Sagittarius, so some of y'all, this could play out in December. Okay. This could be an air sign. Tour oh, I was about to say Taurus. So Taurus is significant here. You could be a Taurus. Um, but I'm picking up on Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have communicate. Um all day long, y'all, I kept hearing, I'm never trading you for nothing. <laughs> this love will make me win <laughs> I had to look up the words, and the song is, like, barely in English. Um, There could be, like, a language component here where y'all speak two different languages Um, from two different places. Okay, but the love is real. The energy, the feeling here, okay, is very much real. I'm hearing um, this person could have been, if this is a masculine, they could have been used to women who were very cheap, like cheap thrills, cheap, cheap vibe, cheap energy, cheap aura. I feel like they got burnt out with that, okay? It was an immediate yes when this person felt your energy. It was an immediate yes when this person saw you. I'm, I'm seeing it's like somebody could have saw you walk in a place or saw you, like they saw you before you saw them. And it was just like a yes. <laughs> Who is that, okay? Um, but I just keep hearing, I'm never trading you for nothing. Wow, sexuality here. And we have spy in reverse. Uh, if there was anyone who is watching you, I feel like spirit has blocked them from your energy. Somebody that you've let go. That's been coming up so heavy lately. Um, let's get into this. I'm never trading you for nothing energy because spirit is also showing me earlier. I told my boo to pick a card out of the out of a deck and he pulled the fidelity card okay so hello this person is coming and bringing fidelity somebody could be mixed with uh african descent and caucasian <sighs> mm, we got untrustworthy here I feel like that's what this person is used to, or that could be what you're used to. Yeah, you just popped out. I feel like that's what you're used to, okay? Um, you could even still have like some sort of insecurities. Cause you see how she's covering his eyes, okay? It's almost like you may be so, not traumatized, but you could have been through a lot with your last connection. And it just kind of puts you on edge when it comes to other, you know, other women, other men around your person, okay? But I'm here to remind you, I'm here to let you know that you are this person's priority, honey. Within love and divine feminine, okay? Because I'm seeing all this change on my table and I just kept hearing two dollar hoe. Like this person is not used to your energy. Like you're the one in love, divine feminine and soulmates okay with priority here like oh my god let's get into this show me more spirit give me one more somebody could be a cheerleader or was a cheerleader this person is going to be your biggest cheerleader too i'm hearing that song um hey so sister i don't want to miss a single thing you do tonight hey Hey, hey, hey. Fantasizing, honey. Sexual tension. Like, ooh, this energy with proposal. You got all this energy. You juicy as a motherfucker. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, <sighs> communication. That's two communication cards with proposal. This person could already be talking about marriage. Okay. 
this person could already be talking about marriage or it's going to go fast, y'all. It's going to go fast. It's going to go fast. It's going to go fast. Um, we got apology in reverse. So this is somebody who's never going to give you a reason to have to apologize or forgive them. You know, like this is somebody who is just like, I mean, what more could you want from it at? In love, divine feminine, priority, fantasizing. Like, hello, this person sees you, honey. Okay, they see you. And there could have been like a discussion that y'all had. This is absolutely my reading and it's hilarious. Um, there could have been a discussion that y'all had where it was like, okay, I'm going to do my thing. You're going to do your thing. Or we're going to separate for some time or we're going to think about things for some time or something. And this person could have made it seem like, um, or maybe somebody proposed taking it slow. Okay, we'll use that example. Yeah, I'm not ready for a full blown commitment. I just wanna get to know somebody, take things slow. I just got out of a relationship. That's cap. That's cap. Look, cause moonlight. This person could be hurt or it could be you that's hurt. Okay, you could have gotten your heart broken recently. Okay, by someone you thought you were going to do life with. Um, I feel like your person knows that you're pretending. If you got on like this front, if you got on this little facade that you don't want nothing serious, okay, they know you're pretending with this moonlight because they know that them feeling this way about you is only going to translate over, okay? Like you got to be feeling this way about them too, you know? Give me one more spirit. Yeah, emotional. You got this person all. Oh, ooh, you got this person feeling all types of ways, honey. With frequency, like the connection is unreal. Okay, the connection is unreal. Irresistible and best friend. Y'all gonna be so goofy together. Y'all are gonna be so goofy together. Yeah, butterflies. Wow, y'all, this is a fairy tale love. <sighs> Irresistible again. Okay. Irresistible again. I feel like this person is going to like be just your type. Like, <sighs> y'all, I'm getting such an overwhelming feeling because not only is this my reading, but this is how this person is going to make you feel like. It's just going to be so juicy, okay? I'm hearing juicy fruit. <laughs> da -na -na -da -na -na -da. Okay, if you don't answer this person, it's going to make them angry. Look, chasing angry. <laughs> They're going to be like, babe, where was you at? Like, five minutes ago when I called you the first time, you should have answered the first time, okay? <laughs> Let's get some tarot on it. Y'all. Ooh, y'all. Wow. One more spirit. I'm hearing I'm um, hung up in love. Yeah, six of swords. I feel like this person is gonna wanna move you to where they're at. Like outside of your energy, it's it's bland, it's boring, it's seasonless. Okay. It's seasonless. It's like this person could just get hung up just get caught up in the thought of you caught up in like the the essence of you just thinking about you just reminiscent memories you know like this is magical magical love um and when i looked up the lyrics to the first song that i uh channeled i'm never trading for nothing one one part of the song i can't really repeat like what he was saying but one part of the song he was like um when you're away it's nothing basically like when you're away i'm not doing nothing this person is so loyal so loyal and the spirit is just repetitively showing me because it happened today this morning because he was like did you bring your um erotica cards he just thinks they're so like funny <laughs> did you bring your erotica cards and i was like or he thought i didn't bring them and i was like yeah i brought them and i showed it to him i was like pick one and he picked out the fidelity card so this person is uh, it's giving fidelity, honey. 
Okay, it's giving fidelity, the person in your energy, collective. Collective. Especially for uh for my masculines listening, okay. If you're if the girl in question is bisexual, okay. Um you know, you're not gonna have to worry about her bumping coochies on the side. Yeah, ace of swords, y'all. And I did the most to pick it up from the ground. I really could have just left it there. Okay, spirit wanted me to see that this person is the truth. You see that crown on that knife? Okay, knives represent truth, communication, intellect. Okay, this person has a royal mindset. Mm, child, this is, I'm about to do a series on this. Okay, because a lot of us have come into union with our, with our SP. Okay, Queen of Pentacles, especially if you are a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Okay, if not, you're about to come into union with your SP, specific person, if y'all don't know. Okay, if y'all be manifesting someone specific, okay. Spe this person can live overseas, you can live overseas, you could be moving and then you meet this person, okay. Show me spirit. Yeah, eight and one, regardless, it's happening fast. I'm hearing within the next eight weeks, y'all will be collaborating, working on something together. Y'all could meet through work here. I'm hearing um, championship already. Okay, so this could be somebody um, in sports. Somebody in sports. Yeah, two of cups, ace of cups. I could not make this up, y'all. This is going to be somebody who wants you around all the time. All the time. Like rain, snow, shine, whatever it is. They're going to be right there with you, okay? Ace of cups, two of cups. This is a brand new beginning in love, y'all. This is beautiful. This is one of the best love readings we've gotten in a long time. Protected, okay? Continue to pray over this union. Yeah. There may be a waiting period, okay? It, there could be more healing that needs to happen between the two of you, okay? But look, my world with passion, this person is already claiming it to be a priority in their life, a big priority in their life, okay? A big priority in their life. Yes, you are mine. I cannot make this up. There is not going to be any broken communication in this connection. Okay, you can inspire this person too. Y'all, spirit is showing me last night. I had to do a personal, I had to do a live reading. Even though I was like on mini vacation, we took like a little road trip to a different part of Mexico called Bacalar. And I told him 30 minutes. Y'all, why he stared at me the whole time I was doing the reading? And the way my boo look at me is like, I be melting. Okay, and he trying to play with my feet. I'm trying to focus on my client, child. Okay, thank God she got the clarity she needed. Obviously, of course, when y'all book with me, it's always going to be that. But it was just like, that's what this person is going to do for you, like, the way they look at you, the way they touch you, the way ugh, I gotta hurry up and tell you. I gotta tell my Instagram girls the tea on on Insta child. Okay, let me keep going. Let me keep going. I'm sorry to talk about myself, but I just know for a fact this is my reading, so it's gonna correlate for y'all. It's gonna correlate for y'all somehow. This person may have piercing eyes. Like you're just gonna love the way that they look at you. Very intimate, very uh, uh. <laughs> Yes, daydream. Okay, opening up. I feel like both of y'all like waited for a love like this. Okay. Both of y'all waited for a love like this. yeah need you this person and look she has a crown on i feel like this person's royal energy recognize your royal energy you know what i mean like they feel like you you have what it takes to sit on the throne next to them you have what it takes 
Yeah. And they're wanting you bad. Needing you bad. Okay? Wanting to protect you. Okay? What, y'all? Karmic battles in reverse. This is not a karmic love. This is not somebody that's going to bring you problems, bring you issues, nothing. Okay? This is a surprise. This love is a surprise. Okay? Yes, I miss you in reverse came out three times and I did not say anything. So I'm like, okay, I miss you in reverse. I feel like you're never going to have, like, you're going to be missing this person, but it's like they're always going to be with you. So it's no point. You know, that's what it's doing with I love you. Okay, divine guidance. Both of y'all are being heavily guided towards each other. Like, this is super romantic. What I say, our love is real. Okay, if you ever was questioning it. Does the collective know this person yet? Oh, I forgot my time cards are still in my suitcase. So we'll do a little part two, maybe. Yeah, communication here. What Y'all are going to always be in communication. Message of love. A little flirtatious text throughout the day, okay? We have hopeful here, a little motivation throughout the day, a little prayer, a little uh, sermon videos, you know, a little motivational videos, tarot videos, whatever it is. Like, this person gonna always just make sure you feel protected. <laughs> protected. Tell me, spirit, what's coming next in this connection? Chemistry, new love. Oh, child. What's coming next in this connection? Whew. Make the effort. Healing family issues. So remember when I said this could uh, not delay, but it could take a little more time because you could still need to heal some family wounds. Um, what's it called? Uh, what's it called when stuff is passed down to you? Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Playfulness. Y'all are going to be giddy together. Okay. Um, what is it called, y'all? When, when, oh my God, I'm drawing a blank. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So if you feel like you were dating, you know, your parents or you were manifesting lovers, out of subconscious wounds that your parents could have inflicted on you generational curses that's what i was trying to say breaking your y'all both of y'all are still having to break generational curses this could also be having to release the ex too okay so when you're dealing with divine love like this it's gonna delay until there is nothing that could come in between it okay show me the next action in this connection here Honeymoon, y'all. Free yourself in reverse. This person not letting you go nowhere. This person never trading you for nothing. Okay, nothing. Yeah, give your relationship a chance. Soulmate, chemistry. So y'all just gonna be getting to know each other, taking time out, being intimate. Uh, I love this, y'all. Is giving me the chills, honey. The chills. It could be cold where y'all are. Yes, wedding. It might be a wedding in the winter season. Okay, express your love. This person could express that they want to marry you, that they feel codependent on you in a healthy way. Okay, this could be the one. Yeah. Oh my. Oh my. Oi. <laughs> Oi. Show me spirit. Show me how this person is feeling about my collective. An overpour of emotions is giving. Reparenting yourself. He heavy family, um, like maybe you have triggers or wounds that this person could see. Like you've been hurt, okay? You could side eye this person a lot. Okay, but look, we have commitment here. So this person sees you as someone they would be in a commitment with. For sure. The sacred woman. This person is looking at you as a sacred woman. And spirit is showing me again when my boo was staring at me while I was doing a reading. He was like so in awe, you know? 
And that's how your person gonna look at you. Sexual freedom, okay? Like they can be themselves sexually with you. Reparenting yourself came out again. This person could feel like you have a good hold over life, like, you know? Yeah, self-respect here. And reparenting yourself came out four times. Let's clarify this reparenting yourself. I was gonna say this person could feel like you, like, take good care of yourself, you know? Like, parent yourself. Like, you could have raised yourself or you just are doing good for yourself, you know? Show me this reparenting yourself. I really want to get this card. Wow, y'all. And I accidentally picked up two. Not even from this deck. We have love offer. Okay, with change. Wow, look what it says. You are being asked to change a part of yourself that no longer feels like the person you, you've become or are becoming. So y'all need to let go of mindsets, triggers, wounds, pain, hurt from your past because it's affecting this connection. This person sees that you're still hurting, okay? But they still bring this love off a child, okay? Change isn't always easy, but letting go of this outdated part of yourself will allow you to align with your true self. So how you act, okay, maybe you are a little childish, okay, in your emotions, okay? Maybe you storm off, you walk off, you're not able to process your emotions properly, you're not able to communicate, okay? That is not going to sit well in this divine connection, okay? So you're just opened a new deck on an offer, y'all like oh my god oh my god oh my god yeah i mean you're gonna have an ex that's gonna come offer you something too this person that's creeping okay could be a gambler but i feel like you hit the jackpot with this new love you did just the one not the two not the three honey okay not the two, not the three. This person gonna be running from groupies. They don't play them type of games. They don't like that. Them two dollar hoes, they don't like that at all. People that like throw themselves at them. Mm -mm. Useless, worthless, no thanks. Okay, yeah. People always partying and shit. Okay, but for some of y'all, y'all have an ex that was always partying. Um, that could be stalking you online and wanting to offer you something, but let's not end the reading like that, y'all. Um, show me spirit. I'm hearing this person gonna be on you like white on rice, Will of fortune. It's about to happen. Okay. Some of y'all about to get pregnant. Yeah. Okay, and spirit is saying keep this on the low. Okay, keep this on the low ski. Yep, because this is your emperor. This is gonna be the father of your children for some of y'all. Ciao. I'm closing this out. This is beautiful. Okay, child. 